what is up will shares uh okay so today i want to do my second video i, I want to say big thanks for the uh, support on my introduction video on whale shares i got a lot of love on that video uh, which was kind of nice to see today i want to talk a little bit about what will make whale shares have value and uh, I also want to talk about, yeah, the WLS token that is being used. I mean, okay, so what creates value? What is going to make this uh, ecosystem grow, for example, compared to the uh, Steam blockchain? I want to say, first, I want to say that this industry of um, digital communities is very big. So I feel that the market can support, would, if a team is extremely responsive, the next uh, few years i mean ideally you could uh, probably have hundreds of um, uh, blockchain system that could grow in value but i feel that one day it's probably going to be some kind of purge to going down to because it's going to be competitive uh, to uh, there's some teams that is going to end up on top as we saw video service youtube uh, social media service uh, Facebook and uh, Twitter for quick messages usually and I also think we saw that with the car industry there were a ton of car brands and then just a few end up on top so I, I saw this article and I want to quickly respond to it it was an article on whale shares and it said why will the WLS token have value where will the demand come from uh, because of content, the resources are well, but the ease of use, the utility provide. Um, I wanna, uh, I wanna, um, I, 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 so the first one it says is because of content. Uh, I wouldn't say that content is actually the real value. Uh, I, I feel that this is something that people many times think, they think that. The content is the value but now when we live in a in the internet age people have access to free content basically everywhere they can just go on youtube watch high quality videos use an ad blocker so content is basically not enough these days to um, to make uh, something have massive value actually i mean even netflix streaming uh, like pay millions of dollars to have these high quality movies uh, and, and tv shows they have that massive leverage to do that same with spotify both of these companies are probably uh, maybe netflix is making or roi but i know that spotify for example that does the same thing with music i mean they sort of struggle and youtube is also struggling to profit from used content because the server cost so i don't think content just magically drives value and i talked about this a lot uh, for example, my Steam blockchain page that I feel that the real value is social relationships, okay? Trust and relationships, social, social relationships. If you can attract people that are super intelligent that can sacrifice, can work hard to, um, to build something amazing and people that are ready to invest a lot of time and attention in something so that is that that is something that really can drive value if you can attract those people into the ecosystem those people that truly truly care and if you truly can develop deeper social relationships if, if, if then that is what's going to drive demand basically so i would love to see whale shares do a system where it's easier to build social relationships so tools to easier build social relationships for example steam blockchain has a reputation system currently i don't see it on uh, whale shares so i'm not sure if there's a plan to get that but yeah i mean whale shares should focus on how can we make it easier to build deeper social relationships right because if you if you can't attract these people that truly care and sacrifice 
and are ready to work hard, um, it's 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 going to be hard to to drive demand. Basically, the thing with content is content has a place for sure, but I also think that in the future we're moving towards automation of content. Uh, especially text content will be automated probably by artificial intelligence. So I feel that well shares, if they can quickly can come up with um, sort of a video platform, that will be good because I think that artificial intelligence is not going to replace that uh, anytime soon. But text content, I feel that people are moving towards, towards more video content. Uh, that is also why I do video content basically because it helps to establish deeper trust and relationships you're basically seeing more of a human and in the age of the internet we when you usually don't see much about a human if they don't do videos it's very hard to develop trust and relationships it's hard to stand out because there's just so much abundant text and uh, blog content basically so i'm very curious about what are the big keys that WellShares is gonna the developers and I'm not sure exactly who is working on this project, but I'm I'm curious what what the bigger plan is like. What what are the like let's say five bullet points that's gonna drive massive value? And uh, because I mean yeah we know these basic things that all the white papers say. Yeah, it's decentralized. It's uh, you can post anything here, censorship free, and all that. But uh, for for a service to truly last a long time, they probably need a bigger vision, uh, a bigger leverage, something that truly adds more value uh, than any other service out there. A team that innovates faster than any one any other team. For example, a big thing with a team is if they can show they care. If they can sacrifice a little bit of their own time and truly listen to the, to a community that are dedicated, uh, that that drives massive value because almost nobody cares these days. Um, so it comes down a lot to sacrifice. Like how much are people willing to sacrifice for growing a system? The cool thing with these new communities, obviously, is everyone is becoming an owner. Of the whole system, so everyone—it's in everyone's best interest that the the, the system grows, right? Uh, which is pretty awesome. I'm also curious if Whale Shares have any plans. What are the plan? Do they have any D app plan basically? Because people want to have in future a big thing is going to be customized interfaces. Drink some coffee here. Yeah, customized interfaces. People want to have their own custom interface that truly stand out. So right now it just looks like uh, Steam blockchain. But if you can customize the home page, uh, one big thing I would love to see is analytics. The cool thing, so we don't have bots here on well shares, so analytics would work better. So if you can create a uh, well shares analytics that kind of works the same as YouTube analytics, that would be magical. And if you would be able to have it as a widget on the homepage, because, 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 because analytics is so key for content creators to track their progress. Like how many views did they get on an article? Uh, this is really, 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 really important stuff. It would also be very useful if you have a notification system on the uh, front page and uh, it would also be pretty pretty epic if um, if uh, a service like Steam Now uh, that exists, the Penguin Pablo did, if you can get a similar system where you can track uh, latest upvotes basically if you can get that system on wear shares. Uh, I feel that the more transparent the dev team can be about what their plans are, what they currently are working on, the the, the deeper buy-in and trust they can create in people. I mean, the more the developers are basically sharing, sharing, sharing amazing stuff that you're doing, uh, the better for the system. So BitTube, for example, I have on Twitter every Friday, they are doing something new to the site. 
they're always updating the community always so they always trigger this effect where people are coming back so yeah uh it's an interesting place especially it's an interesting place because of the limits of the of the tokens compared to the steam blockchain i'm also curious if there are any automation systems that, that are going to be built in because automation is basically the future so it, it would be best to work together with that for example if you can automate some task that you would uh, otherwise is th that you also that you would do so steam blockchain has services like steam auto i think where you can auto do stuff and it's it makes your life frictionless it makes your life easier and uh, pe people love things that makes uh, their life easier so the dev team behind well shares should focus basically on how think bigger than just content because uh, that's going to probably be automated in the future so and the competition is basically coming in a few years uh, there's a lot of lot of companies uh, and teams that are going to try to attract people to their place so i would say that a team should probably think 10x like how can we 10x uh, what we currently do how can we do everything 10x better than anyone else also is a very good strategy because you kind of trick your brain to work harder than harder than <laughs> Um, so yeah, uh, my second video here on uh, WearShares, I'm going to upload it to YouTube because there's no IPFS video service right now on WearShares, hopefully it can come in the future. I'm also curious how big the team is, how many developers that currently works on it, what are their long-term plan. Uh, it would be nice if this was available easy on the front page because Steam also has this play problem where it's hard to see the overall vision, it's hard to see where things are going. Uh, it would be nice to see month to month what are being worked on, what are the strategy in five years, how are they going to deal with competition, and uh, yeah, so I'm going to end this video now, hopefully people enjoyed, and have a great day everyone, bye bye.